congratulations for the fifth anniversary of Strange Neighbors. I just wanted you to know that the Sally Face characters, stories and soundtracks impact my life so positively the last few months that I just wanted to thank you for that. And I am also very excited for the new game and just can't wait for it. So greetings from Europe. Other than being terrific hair inspiration, of course, Sally Face is something that makes me genuinely happy. I'm excited to experience it over and over again, no matter how many years it's been out. In Sally Face, there's a world where weirdness and diversity are accepted as they are, mainly shown by Cell, who's able to see more in a person than there may be strange behavior, and I love this aspect about the game. I'm very grateful that I managed to grow and learn from this game. It's insanely good, and the music just makes Sally Face a masterpiece. It's more than a game, actually, for me. It's like... It was my meaning of life, it taught me a lot, taught me to be friends, taught me to love myself, taught me to be who I am, taught me to fight, to love. Sally Face 对我的意义真的特别大,它是我最喜欢的游戏,然后呢,这个游戏让我认识了很多朋友,也是我开始学习电吉他的原因。I'll keep on loving Sally Face and 五周年快乐。I love everything about that game, especially Lotte. <laughs> He's my biggest crush. It learned me how to um, view life in a different perspective and how to accept myself for my sexuality, which I have a lot of problems with. Sally Face is my favorite indie game and is definitely one of the best games I've ever played. This game literally cured my depression and I am so thankful. It inspired me a lot. I even started playing guitar <laughs> because I wanted to be like Sal. Thank you so much, Steve, for creating this amazing game. We love you. I've been really into the game since it first came out. I cosplay from it. I have a cutout of him watching me do this at this moment. I uh, got into the game during a really stressful point in my life, so it's a huge comfort for me. To Привет. Sally Face – это самая лучшая игра, которую я когда-либо видела. Она очень поднимает мне настроение и вдохновляет меня на творчество. Например, нарисовать что-то или сыграть на гитаре. Все персонажи своеобразные. Я так привязалась к ним, что буду помнить о них всегда. И, конечно же, пять эпизодов невероятно интересные и классные. Очень хочется увидеть продолжение. Sally Face has definitely changed my life, and I mean really, genuinely, because it's brought me into the world of cosplay, which has also brought me into an amazing community where I met a lot of other Sally Face fans, and we all show an amazing interest, and we can all agree that Sally Face is awesome. Sally Face is so cool, and it's just been really fun to be a part of the fandom. I've been obsessed with it for like months on end, so yeah, thank you. Oh my. Sally Face is my everything. Sally Face made me who I am. A lot has happened in my life and I'm a better person for after playing Sally Face. It is absolutely my favorite game. Sally Face for me is a really interesting game that like sparked my love for horror. Sally Face is one of my favorite games of all the time. And I think it's the, it's the first place my favorite game was. I've been obsessed ever since and I've never been able to escape. I love the art, I love the visuals, I love the music, and I love the story. It's all so good. So, we have no one to thank but Portable Moose for making such a great game. It's gotten me through so many things. Sally Face means a lot to me, not just because I grew up with it, but because I have a lot of memories with it. I remember running over to my cousin's house and being like, look at this cool game I got. And we all huddled over the computer. Ever since then, that's one of the most favorite games we've ever played with each other. Sally Face has been such an inspiration on my life. Um, I've written so many stories, I've crafted a bunch of stuff. Um, I have a little bit of an obsession with it. Hello, I'm Felipe Lima from Brazil. Sally Face to me is a precious, precious history, you know? Like, it helped me find myself and my friend. Not just a, an ordinary game anymore. Is part of my life. Ah, uma última coisa. Se você não gosta de metal, nós temos que mudar isso. It is my favorite game in the world. I love it so much. Look, dyeing my hair. It's just, I love the game so much. It means a lot to me. The thing that we love the most about Sally Face is definitely Larry because he is really nice and our favorite character, the one that marks us more towards the game. The game is really complete, especially the story, which is really 
Interesting. And deep. We love study face. Hey everyone, happy anniversary. I just wanted to say that what Sally Face meant for me was kind of an introduction to uh, alternative subculture, metal bands, and indie horror games, which are still my favorite today after five years. So whatever drug you put into this game, you did it well. I can't wait for your other stuff. As someone who's been a fan for a long time, I don't usually find content that panders to almost everything I've ever liked, um, but Sally Face really does, and it's just really important to me to see characters that I can relate to so heavily and I love it. The game means pretty much everything to me. I started playing when I was going through a really tough moment of my life, so it kind of gave me all the happiness that I needed in that moment. And yeah, it holds a really, really special place in my heart. I was going through a really rough patch of depression, and honestly, Sally Face really helped me get through it. It gave me what I would call hope to get through it all. It motivated me to keep going. It really gave me the inspiration that, you know, <laughs> I could do it. You know, if Sal can do it, so could I. So for me, it was hope. Sally Face means hope. Sally Face has a really important place in my heart. It's one of the first games I ever played on my own. Uh, it's what got me into indie games and psychological horror content. It's one of my favorite pieces of media that exists. And it's just this amazing thing that I love and I'm so grateful that it is a thing that exists and I'm so happy to be here to celebrate the five year anniversary. I relate to all the characters, It's it holds a very special place in my heart, it made my childhood, and it always just gave me something to think about. So thank you for making Sally Face and making me feel like a kid again. Sally Face made a really big impact on my life. Um, I actually met one of my great great friends through Sally Face, we had a really bad Sally Face obsession, and that's the way we bonded, and it means a lot to me. And Sal is my comfort character, and... Whenever I feel down, I always look at like fan art and stuff. It just makes me so happy. Hi. <laughs> okay, um, first of all, I'm a French fan from Rain in Island, so my English isn't actually that good, but because of Sally Face, I learn much more vocabulary in English, so that's already a good point. <laughs> and, well, I want to say a lot of things about this game because it's literally my favorite game, literally my comfort game. I don't know why, but when I feel down, I just want to be with Cell and all his friends. Hi, my name is Kenny, and for me, Sally Face plays a really important part in my life because I was in a psych ward when I discovered the game, and it helped me kind of get through the anxiety and fear that I was going through while I was there. And it also helped me find a community that I can feel welcome and accepted in. It's an awesome exploration game with punk themes and ghosts and such, but um, a big thing to me is um, I very much relate to Sal. Just like Sal, I lost my mom and dealt with a lot of teasing, and so I love Sally Face not just for the game, but because Sal Fisher is awesome, and I will always love his character. No, honestly, this game means the world to me. Uh, this game was my first cosplay, it was my first tattoo, it was the first game I ever bought with my own money. This was one of the first things I ever bought with my own money as well. Um, I bought episode 5 months in advance because of how excited I was, I couldn't wait. I met a bunch of amazing people through this game. I owe a lot of my happiness that I have now to this game. So, thank you. This game means the world to me. Uh, I'm Rowan, my pronouns are he, him, and Sally Face has changed so much for me. I played it almost 10 times, um, and it's been my motivation for a lot. I named my cat Gizmo, so, um, yeah, I don't know what I would do without Sally Face. Thank you, Steve. <laughs> Sally Face is a really important part of my life and has been for years. Sally Face literally means the world to me. Um, it really just helped me get through 2020 because I lost a best friend and also because of the pandemic. It's unique and 
painful. <laughs> but that's why I love it so much. And it, yeah, it freaked me out, but it was still amazing. <laughs> I really love Sally Face. It means everything to me. And I met so many people because they like Sally Face. And then I said, oh my god, I like Sally Face too. And we became friends. My name is Gigi. And for me, Sally Face is like my comfort game. Like, I've replayed the game so many times. Like, it's just like that game is like happy. Like, it makes me happy, but it also makes me sad. Really encourages me to continue to make art, even if it's flawed. And I was also going to say that having a character you don't see their face is really important to me as someone with body dysmorphia. Sally face means a lot of things to me and for one it's made my best friend and I bond together and it made us really really happy because of how great this game is. It's amazing to me and it really speaks to me. So thank you Steve for making such a great game and happy fit. Sally face means a lot to me and it helped me when I was in my worst days with medical stuff and it just makes me happy, you know? I love it. Hi, my name is Sav. I started playing Sally Face three days before someone I was in love with had passed away due to an overdose. I had finished playing episode three the night before I found out and I found a lot of comfort in watching Sal grieve too in the later episodes and everything he went through with the journey of death and life and everything in between really helped me grieve and process what had happened to me and what I had lost. So I will always have an emotional attachment to this game and I will never forget the story and everything it did for me. It brought me and so many other people together that it's um, crazy because I now have more friends than I actually did have and it the game just means a lot to me <laughs> like I got connected to Sal and um, Travis really quickly and I was like wow I can relate to these characters I know what it's like to move around. I know what it's like to try to hide who you are and write down your feelings on a note and then throw it away and hope no one sees it. Like, it just helped me become me. It helped me become who I am. It helps me shape who I am. And it really does mean a lot to me. I find myself playing the game time and time again whenever I just need a sense of familiarity. I discovered the game years ago and I still listen to the soundtrack almost every day. Just the characters, the music, the energy in general brings me so much comfort. Um, I don't know why I latched onto the story the way I did, but I'm thankful that I found it because it holds a very special place in my heart. What does Sally Face mean to me? In the beginning I'd like to say I've never been into indie games before, but when I saw the gameplay for the first time, I was mesmerized and felt like this game sends chills down my spine. Story about mental health, friendship, and characters there, I felt like they're almost real. Art style and theme music were something unimaginary. After the first time I played that game, it made me look differently at my illness. It gave me inspiration for the further creative process. I also found new friends in this fandom. I want to admit that for me this is by far one of the best indie games I've ever played. Sally Face has his own world and nothing can be compared to it. Everything is incredible. I can't wait for Sally Face too. Sally Face significa muito para mim. Eu acho que eu nunca fui tão fascinada por um jogo como eu sou por Sally Face. A história, as teorias, os mistérios, a música tudo e cada detalhe no jogo é incrível. Cada episódio do 1 até o 5 é literalmente algo único. Eu adoro o Sal, adoro a sua turma. Enfim, eu amo o mundo do Sally Face. Muito obrigada, Steve, por ter criado um jogo incrível. I just know it means a lot and um it changed my view on a lot of things. And I'm really impressed that you made that by yourself, Steve. I it's insane how much work you put into it. I, it makes me appreciate it a lot more. 
because I look back and play it again and again and again um, at the cool things, and I'm impressed. This game means a lot to me. Thank you. Thank you. This represents a safe place, a place that I know that all the things good and bad about me are cool, that are accepted. And all the characters that give me a sense and save my life a hundred times. Every time that I'm sad, I know that I can count with self face and I really appreciate that. It did come to me at a time when I needed to be reminded to keep fighting the darkness. And like Larry, I also lost my father. And his struggles with that resonated with me. Not to mention his love of metal and art hit me on a personal and spiritual level. I also believe the creator crafted such an amazing world to explore while not holding back on the horror. And for that, I will always love Sally Face. Sally Face feels like something that the priory you want to return to. It feels like home. This game touches something deeply in my soul. And so Sally Face actually helped me discover what I want to do in life, which is major in studio art and English with a concentration in creative writing. And I can't thank Sally Face enough for that, for helping me discover those two passions, because I don't know what I'd be doing if I hadn't found the game. It's amazing that this game managed to bring people from different countries, um, people of different ethnicities, different races, people of different sexualities, gender orientations. It is genuinely amazing that this game managed to bring so many people together. I connect so much to Larry, not only on an interest level with his vast knowledge of metal and love for the arts, but as a survivor of past harm and attempts on my life. It's wonderful to see a character that wasn't demonized for what he did and is truly loved among the community. Larry took what he dealt himself, learned from it, and got back up again and fought for what he needed to finish. He realized that what he did initially didn't make anything better, that it's the journey, the people we meet and love, and the faults that we have that can push us forward and make us better people in the end. Since the first time I found the game, I felt inspired any time I played it or watched it. And since I'm an artist myself, watching other people get inspired just helped me grow so much. And Sally was the first character I got a tattoo about. Sally Face has been a hyperfixation of mine for about a year now, and it's really helped me get through a couple of rough patches lately, like moving to a new place and dealing with gender and coming out to my parents. So I met my partner through Sally Face, um, this one right here. Uh, if it wouldn't have been for Sally Face, I'm pretty sure we never would have met. This game and fandom changed my life completely, but for better. My name is Jenny and I played Sally Face with my best friend Kira. We were laughing, crying, freaking out, but um, yeah, I'm so glad that I played it with my best friend. We were talking about it till this day and it was also very inspiring since I'm an artist and I like to write stories. And I remember I just fell in love with it and I really fell in love with the characters, especially my boy Sal. I remember waiting for each episode to drop, like it gave me something to look forward to. It came into my life when I needed it the most. I was so confused and I felt so lost, but it inspired me to keep going and to keep fighting the darkness and it inspired my art, it inspired my music, and it's overall just inspired my life to help me become more of who I want to be and who I am destined to be. So. Thank you, Steve, for making this game. It's been a great five years.